hey guys so i have never done a video on the cruise so today i have something special actually last month before the lockdown i got these tires and alloys replaced with the stock ones i mean i replaced the stock ones with these so before the lockdown i ordered something that would make these alloys and tires pop a bit more and that is these tire letters um, so yeah some people might not like it but i do um, so i'm going to put uh, these tire letterings on the cruise so it's very simple to do uh, first you need to clean it so i have the worst wheel and tire cleaner in the world the uh, chemical guys this is horrible but smells great then uh, this was supplied along with the kit along with these uh, rubber latex gloves so i have this special tire brush that i will use uh, maybe i'll just mix up a bit of uh, detergent and water and then rinse it rather than using this but uh, yep yeah, so first what i need to do is i need to move the rx100 out all four wheels now i'm going to go to town with a microfiber cloth protection is important because this the glue that is used for sticking these is actually um fake quick mix based basically when i'll glue so it's not a great idea to have that all over your hands so okay um the stock um company print there is one print here and one there so i'll just take a look and see which is longer and based on that we will okay based on that we will, we will uh, figure out where to fix what This is not going to be easy. Thank you. 
This wheel is actually sitting in a very wrong way. The other one is down, so I am going to jump into the front wheel. And then I look at other wheels which are um, easily accessible and based on that I will do the rest. That does look amazing. So I just need to do that to three other wheels. guys check this out so this has really made the whole car look badass you can just see the kind of transformation it brings you know this is just thousand rupee worth uh, a little more than thousand uh, around I think 1300 I don't remember because I paid for it a long time ago so that is an excellent thing it does look like somebody from second or third standard has stuck this uh, I could have actually done it tomorrow morning uh, because there are like you know you can see this is slightly lifting so I need to put a bit more of the glue there and stick it so there will be um, some small amount of work that I need to do but overall this looks awesome so that's quite a transformation so there you go so the first video on cruise a um, couple of things this actually means business so this is not your normal cruise that you can you know catch on the highway i have done some seriously insane speeds on this trust me when i say insane speed it is insane uh, but very stable vehicle um, i've had this for now four years and i've clocked close to 60,000 kilometers on it and you know i can't express you know how the kind of year to year grin it brings every time uh, you know i floor the throttle so there has been some tasteful modifications that i've done to this car as you can see uh, the headlights are different then the front bumper is different and you can see the indicators are also not stock so that is what i've done in the front plus the grill is not stock then when you come towards the rear 
the actual magic happens so these are those BMW type lights um, this is an additional spoiler that I got and press there was a shark fin antenna on top um, which I removed because the clear in on that was peeling and that is painted uh, the finish has come nice but I am not getting time to actually put this on the car so originally this car was uh, not black um, also this this is additional so my wife actually loves this chrome garnish so I really like the completely blacked out look but you know sometimes you have to give in to the missus um, plus this has uh, aftermarket stereo aftermarket speakers uh, also you know this was not supposed to be a tour video but this has a subwoofer a monoblock amp I use only this oil in the cruise nothing else goes in the cruise so you know it, it has been properly taken care of it I bought this used uh, when I bought this it had around 70,000 kilometers on it it was pretty tired um, also one thing that you guys might have missed is the interior um, I didn't like the beach look so I did it uh, in black with blue stitching same scheme on the steering wheel cover as well as the gear lever boot I mean cover not boot this is an auto um, I'm next I'm going to um, do something about the beach on the dashboard as well so yeah um, this car has to go for a full paint I'm not going to do it myself uh, though the paint job on this is original DuPont um, Bentley Beluga black that is the darkest black that you can get on the planet um, but then the guy who said that he will pull it off didn't pull it off well so there are a lot of problems like you can see it is slightly bubbling in this area plus you can see it is all orange peel and then also there is sandpaper scratches under the paint which is visible so this idiot should have actually used the 2k primer that I got him for painting um, this is not my regular painter uh, this was somebody else I thought my regular painter could not pull this off uh, and that was a mistake um, so I actually have two painters my go-to painters one um, is the guy who paints most of the bikes that I have um, so for example this bikes uh, side covers were painted by him the RXZ was painted by him and I have a you know more expensive and better painter who painted the RD350 then you know the painter who painted this so now I think I can pull off something like this but I don't want to risk it because this is my primary car this is not where I can experiment so yeah that's about it under the engine it has some upgrades not major but it you know supposedly does around 230 bhp and a lot of talks which I don't contest because this is scary at you know high speeds um, so yeah that's about it I hope you guys enjoyed the video Please like, share and subscribe if you did. Thank you for watching. Good night.